Hey everyone, I wanted to jump on here and do a quick little video for you guys. I haven't been on here in a while. I have been MIA, but thank you to all of you who have subscribed to Creations by Autumn and thank you to you all who are going to thinking about it and just rocking with me. So um, I did in the past, I did a video on um, my whole makeup routine a simple quick inexpensive makeup routine um i'm a mom of one so i can only imagine the moms and the dads and all of that that have multiple kids because i'm a mom of one and i drop chopped my makeup experience down by a lot because it takes a lot of time but it's easy and it works and it lasts all day so um, you can go back and check that video out but today I am getting ready to go um, somewhere so I'm gonna do a quick little skincare routine that I found simple for me and I love it and it makes my skin feel so good because um, I'm oily and dry on my skin I'm not just one or the other I'm all sometimes oily and then sometimes dry so i'm gonna try to do that really really quickly um what's wrong yeah so i'm gonna try to do that really quickly before we go and uh kind of tell you guys my skincare um that i've been using and that has been successful for me I've done three skincare routines so far and the, this third one has worked. I've stuck with it and it's worked. So what I usually do is I'll have to get the other stuff out of the shower. But I use, um, I can't think of the name of it, at night when I take a shower. Hold on one minute. Let me try to get it. So at night, I use the Equate. Beauty, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's Equate Beauty Deep Clarifying Exfoliating Scrub Cleanse. So this cleanses, it, it cleans the deep, deep into the pores while it gently exfoliating. So you do feel, this is what it looks like. You do feel a, a cool, refreshing sensation and your face like kind of completely like dries out. Like with my face, I get completely like ashy and dry. And then I go into that. But this I only use at night. I only use during the day unless I skip at night. Then I'll do it that day and then I won't do it that night. And then I'll start back the next night. Kind of like that. But I only use this at night. Um, so just to clarify that with this, you will um, get your face. I usually just put a little bit of water on my face to dampen it up. Then I literally take two fingers and just drop right on the top, like one, two, and then just rub around my face. If I made a mistake and did like poured it in my hand and I had way too much. So you only need like two fingers of like two, two, two drops and then you just get it all over your face. Make sure you close your eyes. Don't get it in your eyes because it is a cool, refreshing feel. So I don't know if it'll, it may possibly burn your eyes but it does have a cool refreshing feel to it um and it is it's it's this is what i use for uh nighttime cleansing and that's it but after nighttime cleansing and i do i use the pod the ponds um uh, uh clarent b3 this is for dark spot correcting, um, and it says it even up skin tone in two to four weeks. Uh, and this is for balanced to dry skin, so that's kind of what I use. They do have bigger bottles than that, but I really haven't found the bigger bottle in the pink, the, the Clarence B3. But this is for dark spots, and I use that at night too. And then the Pons uh, Rejuvenesce Anti-Wrinkle Cream in red. So, but I have seen the red and there's a blue one, I think, for only dry skin. Not sure, but it, I think it's just for moisture. But I have seen the blue and the red in um, a bigger bottle. Then I use the Holy Hydration by Elf Skin. The Holy Hydration... Um, 
It's to keep your balance, to it's a balance toner with hyaluronic acid, witch hazel, and aloe. So I use that. But with the things that I use in the morning would be these two, and then I use the holy hydration in the morning. And then I use all of these plus this at night. So then that's just a routine. Then I just use some little cotton pads um, the premium cotton pads. I'm sure you can use cotton balls, you know, what, whatever works. So I'm going to go ahead and do that real quick for you guys to kind of show you. So last night I used this and I used all, oops, used all three of these. So then what I'm going to go ahead and do for this morning, I wash my face, brush my teeth, so I have that cleansed, washed feel. And then I go in with the holy hydration. And you're literally pouring it like maybe one, two, three, four on there. And you get a, I don't know if you can see that, but you got a, it's a little damp in the middle. If you need more, I mean, you can drop it. It kind of, it has a little spout at the top, so it may spill. And then you're ready to go. And then I just go around my forehead, down my T-zone, around my nose, around my eyes, side of my face, around my cheek, above my lip, around the chin, around the other eye, down the side of my face. And this makes you feel so, so good. But I love it. And it's, it doesn't dry up my face. Um, it feels good. Down my neck at the end. Go around my eye. And boom. Then I let that dry for a moment. So this is the Holy Hydration by e.l.f. And it does say it's for skin types dry, oily, and combination. And I'm combination and I love it. So um, the how to use, just for a side note, you apply toner to clean face and neck, avoiding the eye area. So don't get it in your eyes. I could just go around my eyelids a little bit just to kind of get around in that area. And I feel great. So then I go in next with my Clarence B. Um, after my face dries, I usually just dab right like this every time. Just like that. And then I just rub. Yeah. Definitely making sure with this dark spot corrector, I get around my eyes. Like so. I usually have my hair up, but since I'm kind of in a and I did wash my hands before doing my skincare I always do make sure you wash your hands and then start your skincare so that is the Clarent B3 feels very refreshing but it's for uh, dark spot correcting it's a dark spot correcting cream and then the next one I go in with the um, rejuvenesce anti wrinkle cream and I kind of don't go so much with this one as much as I do the B3, but I do go under my eyes. I go along the cheeks, around here in the chin, because you can, on top of the nose, and then to fix the wrinkles on the forehead. Just like that. That's just about as much as I do. Really don't do that much, but just to kind of show you guys. Then I wrap in around the eyes, go around the cheeks, and the stuff that I use around on the chin, I just go around my lip. And then here, I just use around my nose and up. And then get under this eye, down the cheek, 
of this side like that. Mm -hmm. I just kind of do that same circular motion until I get it all rubbed in. Then I'm just gonna go move this one up and down, this one across the and above my eyebrows because you can get wrinkles around your eyebrows. Now that I got it in the areas I want, I'm gonna just start rubbing in. Your face feels so moisturized. Like, I mean, it's minimum uh, amount of skincare, but it works. And I mean, like I said, you go through all of the skincare that you can to figure out what works for you. I did a lot of harsh skincare routines and they didn't work out for me. So that's just what worked. And that is it. That is all the skincare that I do. Um, if, if at all I want to do something just kind of simple with my face, I will just go in with like the, um, uh, concealer, do a little bit of concealer, and then you just go from there. But far as my <coughs> daily and nightly skincare routine, I use the Equate Beauty Deep Clarifying Exfoliating Scrub Cleanse at night. I use the Holy Hydration um, Balance Toner, I guess you can say, for the um, morning and night. I use the Pond's Rejuvenesce uh, Anti-Wrinkle Cream, Anti-Wrinkle Cream, and Morning and Night. And then I use the Pond's Clarent B3 um, Dark Spot Corrector Cream in Morning and Night. So that is my whole skincare routine just wrapped up in one thing. So thank you guys for watching and please make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell.